Hi, welcome back to Impossible 2.0. Next up, I have Aquarius. We have my possible Aquarius at. The time now is 5.59. Aquarius, we doing Da Vinci out this motherfucker today. <laughs> Some of you guys may be dealing with an Aquarius, Aries, or a Taurus. Or you may have Aquarius, Aries, or Taurus, Rising Moon, or Venus. Or your North Node. Okay. Yes, but this is all about action, okay? You're all about action, you're being bold, courageous, you're very defensive, okay? You set those healthy boundaries as well. Um, some of you guys, you know, you guys are blocking out people. The song that I picked up for you guys um, is by a, a rapper named Logic, okay? He's actually an Aquarius, January 22nd. Some of you guys' birthday may be January 22nd as well, but look up the angel number 122. For some reason, Spirit's saying, look up the angel that, that whatever rap artist, uh, artist that I picked up, look up the that angel number, 122, okay? That is five. Changes are on the way, guys, okay? Change your locations, changing up your look. You're changing it up on motherfuckers right now. Okay, but what you are, you, what you guys are doing, you guys are some type of artist. Whatever artist that may be, rap, movies, uh, writing movies, producers. Some of you guys may be into fitness or uh, a lifestyle change you guys are going through. But you guys are going to get a burst of inspiration this week um, as well. Follow your intuitions. Another angel number that I picked up for you guys was 717, which is 6. This is all about compromise, family matters. Okay, yes, I was arguing. Um, yes, <laughs> yeah, I was arguing, but that's over now. So you let shit roll off, like que sera, sera. Okay, hey, Italiano. Some of you guys may be Italian out there as well. Um, yes, que sera, sera is actually Italian for um, whatever will be, will be. Okay, so it's like whatever. It's like you know, it's like whatever with you. Um, yes. Okay, but um. I see people from your past that you haven't spoken to in like a long time, like eons ago, is going to be coming back around. Some of you guys are going to law school, doctors, or, you know, getting to some type of profession. Um, yes, you're gonna, you're, you're getting down to business here. Um, I was told to, to um, pick this deck, and I, speaking about eons, I haven't used this deck in a, I can't even remember. The last time I used this deck, like possibly two years ago <laughs> i don't know but it was a while back so people that you haven't spoken to in a while back is coming back around again i see um confusion and you know somebody trying to stir the pot here but there's a lot of jealous and envious energy uh, uh i'm picking up a lot of jealous and envy in your energy here so is you're very protective of your energy and spirit is protecting you as well somebody is playing with your energy but that's being protected too um everything is being protected you are well protected and whoever is coming in is going to be protective over you as well okay yes they are um what i saw for you guys uh because I shuffle, I, I was I started with this deck. I was gonna start with this deck today, and this is the first card that came out. Protection from evil spirits, purification, good luck and abundance. So luck is on your side. Seven. You may be seeing repeated numbers or mirrored numbers. Seven one seven seven one seven. But seven is all about blessings, Jesus factor, staying prayed up, meditation. Yes, but you are blessed. Your blessings are definitely coming in. Um, yes, the second one I see was onion, protection again, memory, so somebody can't forget about you. Jealous, envy, divine healing, mood swings, and mental instability. Some of you guys may be mental health professionals or, you know, you guys are having mood swings, but you're going through the awakening process. Some of you guys are about to get your wings. Some of you guys are already chosen ones out there, but it's all about your passion, your purpose, okay, what you're here for, what you're made of, all right, leaving your stamp on this world, okay, yes, um, be careful with contracts, signing contracts as well, um, yes, but you guys are, like, coming up with some type of masterpiece, yes, you guys are working hard in silence, all right, <laughs> if people like you, they like you, if they don't, fuck them, you don't really give a fuck, right now, you're about business and your money, contracts, building a team, or doing solo acts, whichever way it goes, you're just doing it. It's all. It's, it's, it's about you. Yeah. This may be uh, somebody athletic. This was the third card. This may be somebody athletic coming in towards you guys. Strong in faith. But you're, it's going to be a renewed sense of faith. Con your confidant, best friend, and protected. So you're protected. Three cards that say protection. Okay? Yes. Um, so we started out. This is the 11th day that I'm doing your reading, guys. So the Ascendant Masters are with you. I wasn't doing your reading because problems with kid, baby daddy. So you may be having problems with family. Um, you know, um, sisters, brothers, neighbors, or, do, you know, just disagreements, but that's over with now, okay? So it's taking the higher road out, but whatever it is, you're well protected, okay? You are, all right? 
Yes. Okay. I can't <laughs> try to get it right. Come on, Da Vinci. Come through. Come through. Da Vinci was an Aries. Okay. I don't know his birth chart, but he was an Aries. I believe his birthday was um, April the 4th or the 5th. I forgot. It's one of those days. But he, he was Aries or the 14th or the 15th. Whatever. You can look it up. But whatever it is, he left a legacy behind. And that's what you're doing. Some of you guys may be visiting Italy as well or be half Italian or you're going to be meeting an Italian. But this is going to be a different culture that's coming in towards you guys. Okay? But this, don't, not to worry though. Not to worry. But we're, you're not focused on that. When this, when this, when it comes in, you're not going to be focused on that. And you're not going to be prepared as well. As a matter of fact, you're going to be guarded and blocked off. All right? But let me get an angel. Let's begin your reading. You know, I'm going to give you a fire reading. So please like, share, and subscribe. Okay? Yes, please like, share, subscribe. 6.05, 1 o'clock now, 11. I did see a 5.59, which is 19. 19 is 10. Closing out cycles. You're entering into a new cycle. So you guys are traveling as well. But new beginnings for you. Okay, you're changing it up on motherfuckers. But change is coming. Um, and again, you're going to be feeling a burst of inspiration. Working out again. Training. Yes, auditioning. Courageous, bold. Okay. 12 is 3, Trinity. We're all spiritually connected. Some of you guys may be public speakers, politicians, or this person coming in. This person is very bold and confident, but you're very protective. As you can see on his vest, this angel vest, there, these are weapons. So you're very protective, but you're bold. Okay, but somewhere in the spotlight, um, I do see a mansion. So some of you guys are purchasing a home, getting a home, or having fights and disagreements with management. But I see a home coming in towards you guys. Some of you guys may be um, dealing with a Gemini or have rising moon Venus, so you know if not a Gemini. Gemini is all about communication and higher learning. So definitely, there's some type, some communication coming in. Okay, or you may communicate for a living, or light workers, or spiritual healers, leaders, or influencers yes there's something that you're doing but whatever it is you're you're uh how can i say you're you're bold you're confident there you go you're confident okay and they know it some of you guys may be of asian culture or this person coming in is of asian culture um or you live in asia or you move to asia or learning that culture or wanting to visit we're all spiritually connected but father her father Son, Holy Spirit. God is in us and we're in God. Okay, yes. Zacchaeus, angel of mercy. Okay, forgiveness. First thing, forgiveness. Okay, so whatever it is, somebody wants your forgiveness, but you're forgiving your past, healing. You are forgiven for whatever it is that you were praying for. You're forgiven. And estrangement. So again, somebody feels like, you know, people want to come back around. They want to end this estrangement or, you know, resolve a situation, compromise. What I said six was. Follow your intuition. Alignment. Yeah, I forgot to mention that. You're coming in alignment. When I see the stars here, you're coming in alignment. But follow your intuitions here. But there may be some type of witchy shit going on in your energy here tower something sudden is about to happen scorpio energy okay but alignment solutions whatever it is the problem is going to be resolved okay peaceful compromise everything i was saying peaceful compromise yes there is a peaceful compromise and releasing pain okay yes i help you fix i help you forgive past wrongs to help clear energetic blocks and transmute any negativity with violet flame blue agate six to 12 months give it time so you're giving yourself time okay six to 12 months so uh okay yeah so we're almost there we're almost to the finish line okay so you're giving yourself time away from people but you may have been working on something and it, and i see the year but something coming around the holidays what i said but october october okay yes oh so let me get another one. So that's Zacchaeus, Angel of Mercy. But somebody wants to end something here. Somebody wants to compromise here. Some, but they feeling pain. Uh, Sabrio, there we go. 23 is 5. Changes. Your health is going to pick up. There's going to be a turnaround in your health. Passing grades here. Rising above the bullshit here. Okay. Um, yes, feeling happy and content as well. But power. In your power. Uh, yes, uh, some of you guys may be 32, 21, 23, uh, yeah, but five, okay, five. Some of you guys are authors out there writing a book, or somebody wants to write something to you here, but again, some of you guys may be health professionals or opening up your own practice, um, but something, there are going to be impossible miracles happening in your life. Sabriel, angel of impossible miracles, 
Yes, nothing is impossible. Swift, something's going to be happening fast. Tower, astonishing surprises. You're going to be mighty surprised. Miracle cure, so there's going to be a turnaround. But some of you guys may be chemists, lab, or, you know, DNA, or something's going to be happening here. But spark of wonder, a burst of inspiration. Rapid healing, yes, and vitality, feeling great again, alive again. Okay, yes, and they're going to see it. Some of you guys are losing weight as well. But call on me when you need an impossible miracle, and I will set a series of events into motion to bring it about. Bloodstone, many timeline, and surprises. There's surprises. There's, there's going to be a surprise happening. Okay, there is. There is. Okay, I just heard sexual healing by Marvin Gaye. <laughs> Marvin Gaye was an Aries as well, and he was, um, unfortunately, he was shot by his dad. His dad, um, you know, had, um, they found out his dad had a brain tumor. And, you know, they had got into an argument and something happened. Uh, well, the dad shot Marvin Gaye, okay? And he was a singer, all right? But I did see, I, I hear his sexual healing. But Marvin Gaye was another legend, legend. You know, he left his stamp on, his, on this world and he died young, unfortunately, okay? He died young, okay? But not to say, but you're going to be... You know, not to say that's going to be you, but I'm just giving you his story. Um, yes. Okay, so health. So some of you guys may suffer from some type of tumor or cancer or some type of health condition. It's going to be a turnaround in your health for the better. Okay, but impossible miracles are going to be happening in your life. All right, so let me get five cards from here. So I'm just going to pick them, plus five, Queen of Pentacles. So yeah, there's a Queen of Pentacles here, energy. I kept seeing her, um, but I wanted to put them face down. That's two. You're all about your money and your stability. Some of you guys are married out there already. Okay, yes. Spirit said make it ten. Okay, well, I'm going to make it ten. Let me just start with five. Okay, somebody's planning something here. A king of wands, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius, or Earth sign, Taurus, Capricorn, Virgo. This person may live a distance as well. You may have been dealing with a player, but somebody wants to come in and send you a message or they're trying to figure out a way, but somebody's all over your social media and they want to take action, okay? But there may be a queen of pentacles here involved or somebody was married. This may have been a third party situation, but I see that you guys are financially stable, okay? It's all about your stability and grounding yourself. Some of you guys may have a fruit tree, grapes, um, apples, plums, oranges but or some of you guys may have a lot of cats highly intuitive here but there is a queen of pentacles in the energy here towards capricorn virgo yes judgment somebody's under judgment here uh scorpio sagittarius some of you guys again maybe music artists but you're marching to your own beat you're going through a powerful transformation uh some of you guys are getting out of a marriage uh traveling as well but awakening you're going through the awakening process somebody wants your forgiveness here but um it is up to you at the end of the day decisions okay but karma is at play here nine of cups yes there's a lot of wishing and magic manifestation taking place here when it comes to you somebody's wishing and hoping for you manifesting you this may be a cancer as well that's coming in but you're protected you see spirit is protecting you from any harm or anyone um but yes there's a lot of wishful thinking here with the nine of cups uh there's wishes coming true as well um, but somebody keep thinking about you and wishing for you and yearning for you. This may be a distance. This person may be at a distance. Two of Pentacles. Yeah. Since right now, some of you guys may have a lot of things going on. Projects. Um, yes, juggling a lot. Some of you guys may be, you know, having money problems as well. Borrow money to pay back money. Or somebody may need your help here. Okay? Yes. But, you know, it's like trying to find balance here and i do see a partnership somebody wants to partner up with you here yeah five of swords there may be jealousy there we go there's somebody jealous and envious over you there may be arguments arising be careful with this energy coming in um yes um but there may be somebody two-faced here playing both sides of the field here but i see people teaming up on you as well okay somebody maybe have a drinking problem or you know be overindulgent but um yes but let's see what's going on here Okay, but I see somebody planning to come in, but there may be somebody very jealous here, okay, over someone, death. Somebody may have passed away here, okay, but I, I see a death and a rebirth, ending toxic situations, ending situations, like, um, 
doing away with people here. Somebody's ashamed to face you here. That was that was stabbing you in your back. You ending you're ending things with these people here. Okay. Yes, this Queen of Pentacles may be a mother-in-law, your own mom, a sister, um, an aunt, a boss. This could be at work as well. Oh, you may be hearing about somebody's death, but somebody's ending something here. And you're ending things with people. Yes, Wheel of Fortune. Okay, some of you guys are going to be getting a new home, but destiny is at play here because you're changing your perspective. Okay, um, you may be dealing with an Aquarius, Taurus, Leo, Scorpio um, as well. You guys are a shooting star. But I see some type of jackpot coming in. Uh, eight of swords. Somebody may be stuck in another situation here uh, or be locked up. Okay. Somebody feels inferior to you as well. Um, yes. They feel like they, you know, they stuck on you here. Or you may be stuck on somebody here or you may be locked up. Eight of wands. Somebody wants to come in to communicate with you here. I do see traveling as well. But communication. Somebody wants to communicate with you here. Okay. Yes. Two of cups. Somebody feels, wow. Wow. Uh, with the two of cups here ace of cups somebody's in love with you here somebody's in love with you here um yes they may feel inferior to you or they may be stuck in another situation where there's fights and arguments and jealousy somebody is decided to come in they're wishing and yearning for you here they can't stop thinking about you they're stuck on you 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 ended something here with someone here um because possibly a third party situation or they're fear, afraid of their family and friends or what people may think about this person this person is a people pleaser um yes okay um they're going back and forth what to do here um they're nervous as well but they're deciding to walk away or to leave a situation here with somebody that's controlling possessive money hungry jealous um there's something is ending here or they're going to be speaking to you about a death here um yes but they're feeling insecure when it comes to you here um somebody may feel like you're out of their league or yeah something like that but Somebody may find you to be their true love. Now, this person may be in another relationship as well, or you may be hearing things about a pregnancy or somebody entraps somebody with a pregnancy here for a relationship, but somebody doesn't want this person here. Somebody is deciding to walk away from this person. They're desiring you, desiring to be with you here, but they know that this is going to cause controversy here and fights and arguments, like I said. I, I, and, and again, um, yeah, th this person may have been married and they're deciding to leave it. To, to, to leave this somebody's awakening to their truth here and they know that this is unhealthy and toxic for them as well um this arguing this entrapment or whatever this is but whatever it is i see a new love coming in for you guys or somebody wants to profess their love for you but somebody with the two of cups there's a partnership coming in like i said and somebody wants to try with you to see where it goes i see business meetings taking place here possibly on the beach somebody wants to i see sex on the beach let me say let me stop some of you guys may love the drink sex on the beach stop thinking nasty but your animals are going to get along you know some of you guys may not have children together uh, may not have children um and your you guys have animals your animals are going to get along or you know take your animal for a walk and meeting up but i see a dinner business negotiations uh, networking, teaming up, somebody wants to be a part of your team, but I do see a partnership. It's your choice at the end of the day. Um, but somebody's in love with you here. Um, yes, and I see that you guys, this person is going to be very romantic as well. Um, this person likes the sunset, or this person may love the beach, or want to take you on some type of vacation, or make an extravagant gesture. Okay, but this is this is this is going to take you by surprise. This is going to take you by surprise. And with the five of wands, there's going to be a lot of comp there's competition. But this person, there's going to be a lot of talks about this and gossip. This person don't care. Um, you know, whoever is coming in, this is somebody that somebody, they, this is people that compete for this person's attention um, or competes for your attention. But whatever it is, people are going to be talking about this. And a lot of people are going to be jealous behind this. Um, yes, because... There was somebody here that possibly wanted to settle down with this person, possibly had a baby or got pregnant um, to keep a person here. But this person here, uh, when they meet you, if you never met this person, they're going to know that you're the one. Because somebody here is not settling or just not jumping in this relationship with, some, with this person. And this is what this person wants. This person wants a relationship and this person doesn't. So when they meet you, they're going to they're gonna, they're gonna, they're gonna start a relationship with you. And it's going to cause a fight and argument, but this person is going to protect you from that. Okay? Yes, they're going to protect you from that. Um, but right now, somebody's uns they're getting themselves out of a situation here. To be, yes, six of cups. There we go. This person may have children, be stuck with children, or a, yes, or this person have kids. But this may be somebody from your past. This person is coming in. They're getting ready to close something out 
to come back to you. They're hopeful that you take their apology. They're mani what I said. They're manifesting you. They're manifesting you. Yes, but they see that you. They're, they're keeping an eye on you here. They're 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 watching you from afar on your social media, and they're in love with you. This person is in love with you. You may have worked with this person once upon a time, or you met at work, or this person wants to work with you to see where it goes and put in the time or put in the time and effort. But this may be somebody new that you're gonna meet at work. Now, this person may have been a player or try to play you, but they play themselves because they end up falling in love with you. I see this person is gonna send you a message, but they see that you're quite content, that you're building something for yourself, you're networking, you're freeing yourself, you feel liberated. Some of you guys are single out there. Some of you guys may have a beach home or live next to the beach. Salt water is very healing, but again, your fruits, your drinks. Some of you guys may be vegans or love pineapple, watermelon, martinis, or you know, fruity drinks. But whoever this is, this may be somebody from your past. You may have kids, they may have kids, but somebody is coming in very romantic, wanting to buy you flowers or you know, bring you some type of gift here. Yes. Okay, somebody wants to apologize as well, but somebody has a crush on you. This person may be younger, but somebody wants to prove to you that they are the person for you, that they are the match for you, they are the one for you. Um, you are everything that they wish for, that they hope for in a person, not this person. This person is only money hungry. This person is very successful, and so are you. Uh, right now, you're focused on your success, okay, but they see you as a masterpiece. They're going to see you as a masterpiece um, as well, okay, but right now, you're very powerful. You're in your power. Um, look at this people uh all your enemies are being defeated they're floating to the top dead fish i heard they're fish some of you guys may be pescatarians as well but taurus capricorn uh i said taurus capricorn virgo taurus air uh taurus aquarius i was gonna say aries scorpio or leo energy some of you guys are traveling or this person may be a distant whatever it is this person may this person wants to 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 meet with you here okay but this person is very successful and again some of you guys are painters picasso oh, i said picasso picasso i don't know what picasso, but leonardo out this motherfucker or somebody wants to paint your picture here but you guys are some type of artist okay but somebody wants your forgiveness here but somebody may have a crush on you here this person is very poetic um this person have the right words as well but this person is manifesting you or manifesting the person like you and you them and so when you meet each other it's going to be boom love at first sight coming together and yes this person may be taller than you as well even if you're a female that's tall this person is going to be taller than you uh very romantic will follow your intuitions okay Yes, this person is a hard worker as well with the tools, okay? But this person is um, an artist. Whatever it is, they're an artist and they're a hard worker. But this person looks good. They take care of themselves. They're coming in emotionally available. If you don't know this person, they, they're, they're going to they're gonna heal your inner child. This person is going to be fun. You're going to go to the amusement park together. This is going to be true love. This is going to take you by surprise, this love, okay, for a pregnancy. But be careful with pregnancy because this person may want to start a family with you as well. Okay? They're coming in for long term. But this is something that you're going to have to think about here. Okay? Yes. You're going to have to think about it. This may be a Virgo, Pisces coming in as well. Scorpio. Um, yes. Okay? But definitely a partnership. And it's gonna. this is going to be true love. True love. All right? Let's continue. Um, I do see uh, social events, um, being invited to a party as well, um, Aquarius, okay? Yes. Sunshine, sunshine. This person, this you're gonna. This person is gonna light up when they see you. They're gonna find you to be positive, optimistic, uh, successful. Is they're gonna find you to be happiness? Their happiness. Okay, their true happiness. But, well, you know, be careful with your light. You got a lot of energy vampires, but you light up the room. As soon as they see you, they're going to see you as bright. Highly intelligent, but bright. They're going to just gravitate to your light like, wow, who's Aquarius? Who's that? See what I'm saying? Yes. But um, this person may live in a hot state, but again, going on vacation, meeting on vacation, extravagant gestures. This person is very extravagant, whoever this is. This is a gentle person, whether this is a woman or a man. They are very generous kind of person, provider, accepting of you and your child, understanding, but good looking. Uh, you're going to feel intimidated by this person as well. They're going to intimidate you, okay? Yes, they are. <laughs> Ooh, this, this, you're not going to expect this. Tower, you're not going to expect this. Like I said before, sunshine. The sun is shining on you, career, 
and business growth. Fabulous communication and relationships, what I said. Pay attention to your girl, Tosh. Pay attention. Pay attention. This is going to be a fire-ass, banging-ass reading. Okay? Yes. Okay, this person. Oh, logic. Okay, so you're being logical about everything. I said logic is an Aquarius. His birthday is January 22nd, and his name is Sir Robert. Okay, so Sir. So this person is like some type of possibly different country, you know, um, you know, monarchy, or have some type of inheritance, something like this. But yes, sir. Yes, ma'am. This person has a lot of, again, a lot of people respect this person, but a lot of people are going to be opposed to this relationship or jealous. Like I said, you, you, wow, yo, this is going to be some shit, okay? Because the person that wants them don't want them, okay? And possibly had a child to, to entrap somebody here, okay? Face, what I said. Face, okay? Yes. Your face, that your, your, something about your beauty stands out to people here models out there be careful with contracts but somebody's going to want to sign you here somebody may be a photographer here somebody finds you to be mysterious you're working in silence they can't move you some of you guys may be into esoteric things tower readers light workers or you know just mysterious they can't read you here um but you're self-made okay yes you don't take every anything at face value or superficial shit they know it some of you guys are just working uh, silent introvert okay you communicate when you need to communicate you're a very straightforward kind of person here they find you to be a no-nonsense kind of person here some of you guys may be some type of makeup artist as well actors actresses um yes mimes um yeah but some of you guys may be mute as well or do sign language or learn sign language or work with you know teach this okay yes um what else Yes, but your beauty stands out. Your eyes may stand out to people as well. People notice your eyes, but people find you to be very serious. You 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 get down to business. So this person may be very serious. Uh, some of you guys are undercover bosses, or this person is an undercover boss, but this person may be well known already and just watching you from afar or a secret account. If you you already have your own social media, they're watching you. Celebrities may be watching you if you have your own social media or you don't know you're some type of light worker or influencer They're watching you. Okay, or you're gonna yes But this is a celebrity coming in or you guys are celebrities or you're gonna make it to celebrity I'm telling you your dreams are gonna come true Face money skills. Yes, so you're making money moves investing money. Yeah, you're all about your money Investor somebody's gonna want to invest in you. Okay, you may have a angel investor as well coming to invest in you taking risks Yes, this is all about taking risks and face value what I said. Okay, so not taking everything anything at face value career self-made fame exposure and reputation yes so but somebody's gonna try to ruin your reputation here but they can't or try to ruin this person they can't but somebody's gonna discover you you're gonna be very fucking famous very famous you're gonna get the exposure yes but this person has a reputation coming in this person is famous already or you're gonna be famous or both of you are gonna be famous but i see you guys both in the spotlight power couple coming in yes Okay, but this person is going to need to discuss with you a few cer certain things about their life um, because there's somebody here that's a drama, a business, either a manager or uh, a person that they have kids with or ex uh, partner or ex-husband and wife that they have problems with that's money hungry that they're going to be discussing a few things with but this person is very fucking good looking where we're coming in i'm picking up somebody that works out somebody that's healthy that's going to put you back on track some of you guys may have gained weight out there, but again, people are going through their own personal karma. But baby, this is going to be so quite a reading, Aquarius. <laughs> this is going to be quite a reading. Okay, yes. Hold on, Aquarius. Ain't playing no games out here. Yes, you're all about business. But this person is about their business. This person, yes. And with the Queen of Pentacles, that's coming out with your first card. They find you to be stable, grounded, and you have a good business sense. Okay? Yes. You're all about your business and your money. Hold on. One card is reverse. Okay. Okay. So let's see what comes out for you, Aquarius. Let's continue this reading because I have a lot of cards to pull for you. U-turn, blockages. Okay, so somebody's trying to block you here, wrong way, obstacles in the way. You feel like there's obstacles or conflict with people, um, but pay attention to the signs and synchronicities. Okay, but somebody's trying to block you. All right, but spirit is saying, pay attention. They're trying to, they're trying to, uh, they're trying to send you signs here. Pay attention to your dreams. 
but somebody's gonna yeah trust your intuition yeah shadow somebody needs to heal their shadow side somebody has an unhealthy ego ego here there may be an opportunist around you be careful because somebody's hitting the block here but somebody craves control somebody's very selfish here as well somebody somebody's um definitely in the 3d here likes to party so fuck yeah but jupiter to pisces sagittarius your money is coming in your good fortune is coming in as well okay yes so be careful with these people uh spinning the block follow your intuitions here when it comes to people here because i see um envy somebody who's prideful and jealous and envious over you here um yes okay yeah but i do see success wealth higher learning and communication but i see good fortune coming in expansion mental and spiritual development you're under mental you're under mental and spiritual development here okay heart yes you're still working on your heart chakra here but somebody love is being activated somebody has unconditional love for you but you're putting the love into yourself okay there's all it's all about awareness transformation and change with you you're going with the flow energy flow okay yes forgiveness you're forgiving yourself forgiving the past uh-huh mars Aries, Scorpio energy, fiery, passionate, new beginnings for you. You're feeling motivated, okay, confident. I see that you're going to be getting some type of honors, uh, you know, some type of award coming your way as well, okay, but you're brave. You're ready. You're ready. You're protective, but you're ready for war, whatever it is. Okay, said ah, said ah. Yeah, that's how you feel, like, yo, but you're staying away from it, okay, Virgo. This may be a Virgo in your energy, okay. But this is all about critical thinking, being analytical, paying attention to the details, um, responsibilities as well. But there's somebody helpful coming in. Okay. Yes. But this is all about patience. But you're highly intelligent. Okay. Yes. And resilient. Root. Okay. You're grounded. Okay. Yes. This is all about you're grounding yourself. It's about your stability, your security, feeling safe. But you're focused. You're focused. Okay. And you have healthy survival instincts. Some of you guys are abstinent or abstaining from sex as well, but your sex life is about to pick up. I tell you that much. Yes, there's a soulmate coming in. We're gonna, I'm gonna see who this soulmate is. Possibly a king of fire, Aries, your Sagittarius. Somebody wants to take action towards you. This person looks good. Whoever this is, yes, communication. What I said, Gemini, communication is coming in. Some of you guys are writers, screenplay writers, directors, producers, but somebody wants to send you a message. Somebody may be left-handed or this person may be left-handed. This person may wear a cross or be, um, wear a lot of spiritual braces or be very spiritual or come from a religious background and uh, in between worlds, okay, learning about spirituality. Some of you guys may be ghost writers as well, proofreaders, authors, um, auto autobiography, or somebody's they're going to be asking for your autograph here, signing contracts, but definitely communication coming in, okay? Yes, Venus, Taurus, Libra. Wow, you're in your Empress energy here, bossing the fuck up. Yes, you know your value, you know your worth. Uh, some of you guys may work for the law, um, balance. Some of you guys may be military as well. Um, but I do see uh, business relationships, okay? But your beauty stands out. You're very good looking, um, handsome, beautiful. You groom yourself. You got a nice body. Um, yes, I do, do see you developing friendships as well. But your abundance is coming in. Love, money, abundance, luck. Yes, marriage. Your new love is coming in. Mm -hmm. This may be an Aquarius. This is gonna be sudden change, unpredictable. But you're unpredictable. You're unpredictable to people as well. But this is about your independence. Some of you guys may not want to settle down here, um, but somebody's gonna see your value. Okay. Some of you guys may be pregnant, mothers, fathers out there as well. But with the Venus here, this is Empress. Okay. So yes, some of you guys are business owner or working on self employment. They see it. Okay. But networking. Somebody wants to work with you here. Okay. Yes, Ace of Cups. Whoa, boom. There may be a pregnancy or somebody wants to start a family with you. Be careful, but this is a new love coming in, new relationship, a celebration, possibly a baby shower. Um, yes, but happiness being restored, a new romance. Yes, getting to know each other as well. Yes, Gemini. This may be a Gemini. Okay, this person is outgoing, playful. This person may be younger. Lovers. You're going to have a choice here. Gemini energy coming through hard. Uh, somebody may have been married here, put you in a third party, but somebody found find you to be their true love. They want to communicate with you. There's somebody that's married that's in love with you here. That's for some of you guys. Uh, but you're going to have a choice of love. You're going to have options or somebody may have treated you like an option here. Yes, right now you're in your personal power, clarity of judgment. You're seeing things clearly. Okay, you're not fucking around with people here. Yeah. 
You're not fucking around. Okay, cancer, there may be a cancer involved or cancer is coming in. Follow your intuitions. Right now, you're developing your life purpose, what you're here for. Yes, there may be a queen of earth is coming through, Taurus, Capricorn, Virgo, or somebody's married here. But there's somebody nurturing, sensitive, protective, coming in, humorous, somebody who's family focused as well. But you have, this, do you, you have the power to see the past, present, and future. You may be, work in a library. You'll have a library in your home or love a lot of books to read, spiritual gifts. You're developing your spiritual gifts. Yes, uh, you're working in silence, but there's some type of deception and secrecy surrounding a queen of earth here as well. There may be a Leo in your energy, okay, but you're very bold, courageous. There may be a Pisces as well, okay, yes. Somebody may be secretly married, but I'm going to see this deception, this hidden truth here with this queen of pentacles. Yes, because I, I see, I can see her, okay? Yes, this may be a Capricorn, and I get a Leo, but you're hard at work. This person may be hardworking, ambitious, a leader. This person is in control. Yes, secrets. There's, there's some type of secrets here. It's cheating, lying. Yes, you're breaking generational curses. There may be a Scorpio involved in this situation as well. Okay, but you're you're very successful. You're gonna be very successful, or this person is successful, brave, okay, loyal, um, intelligent. Okay, yes, breaking those generational curses. Some of you guys may have been the black sheep. There you go, divine feminine. You're in your divine feminine. They see it, they see it, the world. Okay, some of you guys are very successful, but I do see you guys are gonna be very successful. You no know, worldwide, something is about to take off. Yes, truth, that's the truth. Okay, there's a divine masculine coming in, but a masculine energy that's watching you here. Uh, somebody's gonna reach out to you on the internet or on social media or send you a text. But I see things closing out and you're entering into a new phase, new beginnings coming be uh, your your yeah. Um, wholeness. Wow. You're going to be building your empire. They see you building your empire. You may meet this person around the holidays. This person very well, much be, may be a Capricorn. Um, but I see around the holidays or a holiday party here, this person may have money. Yes. Be careful with a king of fire. Somebody who's an opportunist. This may be a Scorpio, Aries, or Sagittarius, but there's a player here that's looking at your money here. Okay. Be careful with this energy here. Okay. Yes. But I see worldwide success for you, a breakthrough when it comes to the internet and somebody discovering your talents, exposure, self-made, fame, reputation. Yes, Aries, this may be an Aries. You're going to be a crossroads. Sagittarius coming through. Um, yes. Wow, you're going to be having a lot of... There, there you go. Your divine masculine is coming in. Your perfect match. Okay, yes, somebody may be in the dark night of the soul here as well. Yes, healers. Some of you guys may be healers, shamans, spiritual healers. Okay, yes, somebody may have had a side piece or try to treat you like a side piece. And now they're seeing the truth. Yes, the king of earth, Taurus, Capricorn, Virgo. Somebody possibly was married here. Um, yes, wow, I see that you're going to be moving. Somebody's keeping an eye on you here secretly. I just saw it. Wow, your money, wow, your money is coming in as well. But somebody's watching you here. Somebody may have, yeah, somebody's watching you. Somebody may have had a sex addiction. You let this go. Somebody may be getting tirades on you as well. But somebody's watching you here. Okay, somebody's trying to manifest you uh, or connect with you on the 5D. Somebody who has unconditional love, possibly a king of earth. Yes, they're trying to connect with you here. This person is highly intuitive. But this person may have put you in a third party. This person feels like, yeah, they put you in a third party. There you go. Yeah, there you go. This person feels like they're a part of your soul tribe or you understand them. They fucked up on a good thing here, but they treat you like an option. But now they feel like you have options. Follow your intuitions with this person. But this person is getting downloads about you. They feel like you are you were sent to them for a reason. Um, they want to make you an offer, but there's a new beginning and a new offer coming in. Ace of Cups, Ace of Pentacles, a new job, a promotion, but lots of money coming in, a back payment. Uh, King of Swords, yes, karma. Karma is at play here. Some of you guys are light workers. This may be a Taurus coming in. But somebody's going through karma. Your spirit team is protecting you from these people and their bullshit here because somebody's trying to bind you. Because I did see um spell work the last time. Okay, but you're 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 logical right now. Okay. It's all about discipline, stru structure, and isolating yourself. Yes. Okay. Yeah. You're also and you're being called for a higher purpose and you're answering the call. This may be a Taurus coming in. Um, as well, okay, watching you, but let's see who's watching you, all right, hold on, by the way, I forgot to mention the song Logic by Logic, it's called Fade Away, Logic, that's the rapper name, he says, all day, 
every day. You're going to know my name until it fade away. So they're going to know your name until it fade away. Okay? Yes. Face. Yes. They're going to know you. Sunshine. You're going to be shining bright. Luck is on your side. Okay? Sunshine. Yellow. Yes. But things being illuminated. But they're going to know your name until it fade away. You're leaving your stamp. You're leaving the, your, your, your name behind. Your legacy behind. Yes. Or you are well known already. Or you're going to be meeting someone. But this is going to be a power couple. Your, 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 your half is coming in. So look up that song, Fade Away by Logic. He's an Aquarius. January 22nd, like I said. All right? Let's continue here. Because I have more card support and I still have to end your reading with tarot. Okay? But you know, I go, I always give you guys a banging ass reading. So again, please like, share, and subscribe. When I hit 55,000, I'm going to be giving away my Love Jones deck to 10 lucky winners. And, you know, yes. And I'm going to try to be putting out readings this week. But I have my son. My son just left today. Okay? Yes. And then I have to pick him up on Friday again. So busy, busy, busy. Yes, knowing the path. There you go. You're you're following your life purpose. Okay, you're leaving whatever. You're aligning with your purpose. You're coming in alignment. The stars. The stars are aligning for you. Okay? But accepting your story, the past is the past, and you're on the right track. 11. You're on the right track. And you're the 11th sign of the month. And this is the 11th day. But 10, closing out cycles, a new cycle beginning. Yes. You know what it is. You're being strategic. Okay? But somebody's being strategic here. They're planning something here. But you're planning your next move. Making power moves. Connecting with the right people. Yes. Okay? But you're leaving nothing to chance. Being clever. Okay? But this is not chess anymore. This is fucking dominoes. Because when this shit hit, this shit is going to be a domino effect. You're going to be victorious. All, you're going to be winning all across the board. Yes. Freedom. Yes. Freedom. The freedom to express yourself. This is about your independence. You're doing a solo act here. It's not about anybody. Some of you guys may be born in the year the horse. Or this person may be born in the year the horse. Or this person has a horse. You know what? You know what I'm saying? Giddy up. Giddy up. Like that. But you just focus on your independence. You're doing a solo ride. Okay. Yes, some of you guys are happily single, and you're not selling it for less. Something is brewing, though, but somebody's doing some bullshit here. But somebody's at a breaking point here, but somebody's manifesting you. And I do see a love spell. Yes, they're going to be gossiped, they're, or people are gossiping about you, but somebody's losing their emotional strength. These people, they're low vibrational. You're getting rid of these motherfuckers. The end with these motherfuckers. You don't care. Let them gossip, because the more they gossip about you and talk about you, that's how your name going to get around. <laughs> There's an engagement. They're going to be talking about this engagement. Whoever's coming in, you're going to end up marrying this person. Yes, this person is coming in for long term, and this person is coming in with a lot of money too. Okay, but there's marriage in your future. Somebody's going to make it official. Somebody's going to be talking about this person. This, this is going to be a secret here, but you're moving in silence. But you have a secret admirer here as well, but there's more to be revealed. Okay. Whoa, yes, this is going to be your true love. You're going to be nervous about this. Yes, follow your intuitions. They may, you may, you may be a tarot reader, light worker, influencer, but they, they, you know, this person is into esoteric things as well. This person is spiritual. They belong to your soul tribe, but follow your intuition. But this person may find it, feel like you could read their mind or you just have a knowing. They're nervous about this. They're nervous. They're nervous. <laughs> They're nervous. Okay, yes. But, yeah, some of you guys need a reading. My information is down below. If you, if you would like a personal reading, all my information is down below. Plastic. Okay, yes, yeah, somebody's plastic. These these fake people you're getting rid of, they you see right through them. And this person sees people as fake as well. This person is big, breaking out of the matrix, okay? They see that you're a real one, okay? Yes, they're tired of, um, you know, the fakeness. Um, but whoever it is, they always dealt with fake people. Or you, or you always ran across fake people. But whatever it is, you're seeing people for who they are. Plastic. Fake. Yes. Unrequited. Yes. Okay. I'm telling you right now. There's somebody here. Uh, this is a situation here. Uh, yeah, somebody wants to date you. Somebody's going to be ghosting someone here. Somebody, okay. Somebody feels like, yes, ghosting somebody that they have children with. Okay. Yes. You may meet this person on vacation. Uh, but let me tell you this, this is, this is quite a story I'm picking up here. So somebody had a child with, with someone here. Okay. Yeah. You're setting those healthy boundaries. Okay. Somebody feel like their time is running out when it comes to you, but there's somebody here that's fake, money hungry, uh, a Barbie doll that they think that, you know, um, 
they could have whatever they want or children keep a person here or whatever this person is 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 following their intuitions they're realizing that this person is fake this world is fake people are fake they only with you because of money or status and children somebody had a child but this person is going to explain something to you here but it's unrequited love somebody wants somebody to engage with them like engage them marry them settle down with them but Whoever this is going to free themselves, they're being strategic and they're going to free themselves because they know the path. There's going to be a lot of gossip surrounding this here, but somebody is being exposed for their fakeness here, but it's a one-sided love here. Somebody just had children with someone or kept a child to keep someone, but it was unrequited love. This person is getting ghosted and blocked here. Somebody wants to come in to date you here. They're going to explain something to you here as well, but somebody wants to date you here, okay? Yes, they want to get to know you. Okay. Yes. Don't worry about. Don't worry about this person. I'm gonna explain this person to you. Okay. Yes. Whoever they're with is a narcissist as well. So yes. Somebody wants to take a chance with you. Okay. But there may be a baby mom, queen of cups involved, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio involved in this situation. But somebody wants to lay their cards down with you. They want to take a chance with you. They want to. They want. They want to. 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 They feel like you're again somebody that's hard to read. They can't read you. But they want to know you. Okay, they want to journey into the unknown with you. Yes. They feel like, yeah, that they, you're the one. I mean, even when they, they this is going to be some, some bomb shit. They're going to offer you, that's what I said. <laughs> they're going to take a risk and they're going to make a love offer to you. Yes, a job offer that you're going to love, a love offer, but somebody's going to be sincere when they come in. Yes, they feel... This person is old school. They want to date you. They're going to they take things seriously. Even if they're younger than you, don't reject this person because they're younger than you. As a matter of fact, um, this person may be 34, 10, 10 to 12 years younger than 5, 10, 12 years younger than you for some of you guys or or older. They're either older or younger. Something like this I'm picking up with this person. Logic is 34 years old. He was born January 22nd, 1990 in Maryland. Some of you guys may be from Maryland as well, but his name is Sir Robert. Some of you guys name may be Robert, Bobby, Bella, okay? But this person is going to be find you to be Bella, Bella, okay? Beautiful. This person may be Italian, like I said, or different culture, but this person is a made person, okay? Self-made as well, but... This person is well known and there's going to be a lot of jealousy and gossip. Um, yes. Okay. But they want to take a risk with you. They're going to, I'm telling you, this is a story that I'm picking up here. Yes. This is a soul mate coming in. This person may be a music artist, but you're going to be music to their soul. You hear what I'm saying? They're going to, they're going to find you to be a masterpiece. They even going to fucking, fucking write a song about you, paint a picture about you. Hey, they're going to do something, but it's going to be love at first sight, black and white. It's going to be balanced. Okay. Yes. Uh, this person is going to sing to you, but it's going to be harmonious, in sync, aligned. Yes. Okay. Whoa. This is going to be very healing to you as well. This relationship, this person. Yes. Okay. Uh, lessons. Okay. You learn your lessons. You know the path. And this person is learning from you as well. But this person is going to sacrifice something in the name of love. Somebody wants to reconcile here as well. Follow Again, you're going to have options. Follow your intuition. Somebody's going to be angry but that you're moving on with somebody else here. Or there's people angry at you, at your status, your success, or this person being a star and a celebrity. <laughs> Pay attention. Pay attention. Okay, but they're going to be jealous because and angry and, and, and have a lot of resentment because they missed their chance with you. You don't want to reconcile with anybody. I don't see you taking anybody back. You're going to go for this new person. This person is going to be very healing, but this person is very successful or some type of celebrity. Or you are, but this is your energy. Okay, and you're going to be very healing to this person, even your sex. Great sex together as well. Yes, somebody's trapped in their mind, trapped over you. Uh, yes, somebody who unvalued you. Okay, now they're going to see your value when this person comes in. They're going to want to chase you back, want you back, reconcile, come with flowers. But yeah, because this person was a jackass. There you go. Somebody's secretly stalking you. Um, you're going to be be expected communication and a phone call here. Somebody's depressed without you, drinking, smoking. That's not your fucking problem, okay? Or they had you depressed, all right? Yes. I'm telling you, this is going to be some bullshit here, okay? Yeah. Runner came out fumble. Somebody doesn't want to run anymore. They feel like their time is running out, but they chose somebody else over you as well. Yes. Yeah, what I said, jealousy. You have a lot of people that's jealous over you, okay? There's a wish being granted. There's a, a, a wish fulfillment of yours 
coming true. All that you ever wanted. A dream boy, dream girl coming in. Somebody's love is being activated for you as well. You may possibly meet this person on vacation. Okay? Yes. This person is going to be mutual feelings between you and this person. Yeah. What I said. This person is going to make an extravagant gesture. Okay? You guys are going to be in the spotlight. Yeah, somebody who was stringing you along wants to come back around again. But the, whoever this is has money in the spotlight. You're going to be in the spotlight together. Opposites. You're going to be opposite from this person, but that's what they're going to like. They're going to like it. They're going to like it. They're going to like it because once they get to know you, they're going to find you to be very spicy. Yes. You're going to teach them things. You're going to show them a, a different and they're going to love it. But somebody who, but now you're stringing people along. Okay. Yes. But somebody was stringing you along, a runner, and now they're going to be chasing you. They're going to be jealous and angry, a lot of people, and they're going to be gossiping about you when you meet this person or when you get with this person. It's not like they weren't doing it before, but this is going to be true love, your soulmate, a divine connection. You're going to, this person has an empire on you. They're going to build with you. And you're going to be, you, you're going to be breaking, you're going to be the first one to break generational curses, the first millionaire in your family. Yeah, so somebody's, be expecting a phone call, their secretary or whoever reaching out to you, and somebody's secretly stalking you here. Like I said, they're watching you, okay? And we're going to, we're going to find out who that is, all right? Let me get one of these. Phoenix, what was lost is being restored. This is going to be teamwork. Yes, the end. You're putting the end to things, but a definite rebirth. Scorpio, heavy Scorpio energy coming through here. Yes, but you're being offered a second chance. Okay, but you guys are going to make a great team as well. Okay, yeah, but there's going to be a lot of jealousy and envy around this. But be careful with people at work. Okay, so you may be ending a job, career change happening here, or ending a partnership as well. Be careful with tempting offers. Some of you guys may be going to be a snake or this person. Okay, yes, but getting down to business. What I said, writing down your ideas, you're very bright. This person is going to find you to be very bright, knowledgeable, but your light shines. Okay, yes, your light shines. This person is a leader, so are you. Okay, you're taking the lead. You're rebuilding yourself after loss, and I see date. There's a date. There is a date coming. There is a date, okay? <laughs> be open. But, yes, somebody wants to rebuild it. Yes, this is something that you're manifesting. You're going to be hearing some type of good news surrounding business. Um, business taking off. Projects taking off. Um, a, a date. Okay, getting dressed. Getting your hair done. Um, yes, everything is happening in divine timing. But you're all about time management. Uh-huh. You may travel to see each other. But building the bridge. Connecting with the right people. Finding common ground here. Yeah. Some of you guys are going for cosmetic surgery. Healing from cosmetic surgery. Or somebody trying to ruin your reputation. Some of you guys may be hairdressers as well. Yeah. Sadness. Okay. That came out. Somebody's going to be fucking sad. Or you may be hearing some type of sad news. But somebody's depressed. A lot of regrets when it came to you. Okay. Poor mental health. For deceiving you here, these people are a hot mess, a man in particular, because your luck is about to change. There's a man, there's a man with luck coming in, okay? But this hot mess are people, people going through their karma. Yes, round and around, karmic cycles. They're going through chaos. Somebody feels like they have unfinished business with you, but this person is drama, okay? Yes. This person is drinking, be expecting a drunk phone call, or this person gets high or have some type of addiction, sex addiction. But this person chose a rivalry. This person may have mental health issues as well, but they're sad and they're depressed without you. Okay? Because your luck is turning around. And I see a man is coming in. Man, woman, this is unisex that's gonna come in. Um and play a key role in your in, in your in your in your life. Okay, five and six. Uh, the ladybugs, one have five and one have six. This is 11. The ascended masters are with you. This is a soulmate, soul union coming in. Okay? And you're going to be dating and getting to know each other. You're lucky. You're, you may be my lucky star. Madonna. Madonna's are actually a Leo, so this may be a Leo. Okay? Yes. Or a singer, like I said. But, um, yes. Let's see who this person is that's coming in. Let's get to that.
adolescents. This person may be younger than you. Uh, play some type of sports or football. Okay. Yes. This person may be an air sign, um, Aquarius, Gemini, Libra. This person may be some type of fitness or athlete. Um, yes, what I said, fitness or athlete, travel. This person is travel and adventure. Take you on extravagant trips, something like this. Pay for your trip. Yes, this person may be an actor, actress, screen time, quality time, want to watch movies with you. Yes, this person is highly intelligent as well. Possibly in their 20s, like to ride skateboard, very daring, have locks in their hair or braids, um, have a dress down look or dress very nice. Or even if they're older, they're, they dress very nice and yeah they, they they have a good dress dressing sense you're gonna notice that they're clean cut as well they take care of themselves yeah what I said beauty and fashion this person may find you to be very beautiful very handsome or fashionable what I said this person beauty stands out and they're fashionable okay social butterfly this person may have a tattoo or you have a tattoo of a butterfly but there's gonna be a lot of communication between you and this person you're gonna open up to this person they're going to open up to you. They're, yes, this person is very confident, bold. This person might be a Leo um, as well. Yes. You may have been dealing with an, uh, a narcissist that was a procrastinator here. But this person is spontaneous. Okay. Yes. Carl Thomas. Cartomancy. Uh, uh, Cartomancy. This person may be uh, into esoteric things, tarot reader, or again, tarot readings on you, but people are under judgment. Um, yes, somebody may be a light worker here, but procrastinator. This person feels like they don't measure up to you. Okay, yes, this person is down to earth or maybe an earth sign, Taurus, Capricorn, Virgo. Um, they find you to be down to earth as well, but they're going to be intimidated by you or you dumb, but you're going to take your time with this. Okay, this person is faithful, loyal coming in. As well, you're going to take a chance with this person. Okay, yes. This person may be tan complexion. Okay. This person is funny, has a sense of humor. Long curly hair. Multilingual or a different country. This person may be a tattoo artist, have blonde hair, a musician, uh, have a lot of tattoos, piercings. This person is some type of perform performer or performing arts. One more. Yes, this person may have children, okay? This person may be LGBTQ community or you or be into some type of politics, okay? Yes, this person is spontaneous and they, they're going to take a chance with you, all right? They want to take a chance with you and you're going to take a chance with them. But this person is like unpredictable. Like they just pick up and say, all right, Aquarius, let's go here. Let's go there like this. This person has a young spirit. But I, again, like I said, even if they're younger than you, you know, this person is going to heal your inner child. They're going to bring that youth back into you. Okay, so Spirit wants you to be open-minded and optimistic about whoever is coming in and they look good. They're going to try, they're going to kind of intimidate you as well. Like, you know, they're going to be like, oh, no, whoa, whoa, whoa. Okay. <clears throat> but this person has a lot of stamina. Okay. Just, yes, they have a lot of stamina. All right. But let's go. <laughs> Que sera, sera. Yes, all that glitters. Okay, yeah. So be careful with an opportunist or too good to be true. Uh, yes, but people mask are falling off here. Plastic. All right, but somebody's money hungry here. Uh, um, yes. Okay, but again, weighing out your options, follow your intuitions here. Okay. Yes. Buy the book. Came in reverse. Okay, you're doing things by your book. Yes. And somebody here is getting out of a family or a set belief. Like I said, somebody's getting out of a set belief or a family. Um, and they want to start with you. 11, the Ascended Masters are with you. 16 is 7. Your blessings are coming in. I see a lot of financial abundance coming in. Yes, there's a Yang energy coming in. Divine Masculine. A faded meeting happening between you and this person here. And again, star status. This person is like a star seed, indigo child, a chosen one just like you. But this person has star power and so do you. Okay? Yes. But even if you're a female, you possess a lot of masculine energy. You're not just going to be selling it for anyone. You're, you're, you're laying the rules down. You're very bold and courageous and they're going to see it. You're a no-nonsense kind of fucking person here. Yes. But this is a faded meeting destined to meet each other here. Okay? One more. Yes, but you, you, yes, you not a care in the world. What will be, will be. Whatever will be, will be. But you're loving yourself, taking care of yourself, healing yourself. Yes, doing the, yes, a leg up. So this person is a leg up. 
but somebody needs a leg up, but you're going to get, you're going to get a boost of inspiration here. And again, you're going to get some type of exposure. Somebody's going to know that you're here. You're going to get some type of help along the way, but whatever it is, you're icing people out. But I see something around winter time. Okay. But this person is a boss, but older, younger. Okay. Yes. Yeah. You're going to get a jump start here. This person may be 34 or 43 years old. Like I said, because um, the rap artist logic is 34, okay? Yes, so there may be an age difference. But whatever it is, this person is going to be right for you. Divinely sent to you. Fated meeting. Fated. Fated to happen. Destined to happen. Yes. But destiny is at play here as well. Natural born leader. There you go. 11 again. So you're a natural born leader. You're taking the lead. <laughs> you were born to lead others. It is a part of your life path. There you go. So you're born, the, and whoever this is, is a boss, and they're going to see your boss like qualities. Okay? Yes. They're going to see it. Like, wow. They see that you're all about business. Yeah. And you're taking the lead. Ain't nobody controlling you and running Aquarius. Are you crazy? I give orders. You don't give me orders. I give orders. Okay? Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, some of you guys may love pizza or work for Domino's. I just picked that up. Yeah. Or trying new recipes. Significance, you be you, and you're holding people accountable for their actions. Okay, I wasn't ready for these two. But, yes, you're well protected along your journey. Some of you guys may have bodyguards of this person. Um, yes, this person may be tall. Uh, again, taller than you. Uh, yes, there may be a height difference. But you be you. But no matter how big, you're standing up. You're standing your ground with people. Um, and yes, and this person is going to, they're going to notice you. Yeah, you, you stand out from the crowd. There you go. They're going to notice you, your qualities. Yes, and, but this person is going to be very protective and possibly put bodyguards. Yeah, but you're holding people accountable for their own actions as well. Clean up your own fucking mess. That ain't my mess. Somebody's ashamed to face you here as well for what they did to you. People. Yes, but allowing it, let it happen, knowing the path. So trusting, you're trusting in the divine, you're trusting in the universe, you're trusting in God, you're trusting in your spirit team. You're allowing things to happen, you're letting go of control, you're going with the flow. That's very good. Okay? Yes, and you're going to be content at the end. Yes, some of you guys may be, you know, love to swim, have a pool, or this person loves to swim or have a pool. But I see you purchasing a home with a pool if you don't have a home with a pool already. Okay, but take your spiritual back. But you're going to be satisfied in the end. Yes, you are. Okay. Yes. Right now is about self-reflection, introspection. You're releasing and letting go, forgiving the past, healing. But spirits, you know, spirit is saying, don't stay inside that box. Get out of your head. But you're maybe overthinking a situation here, but you're still healing. You'll give yourself time. You're taking your sweet fucking time. Okay, yes, you're embracing the unknown. Be, be prepared for your rewards coming in. But somebody wants to somebody wants to get to know you here. But the but the what we say, the heavens are opening up for you. And you're relying on the higher ups. Okay, you're not relying on earthly things. You're relying on heavenly things. And you're ready for it. You're ready. You're ready to take that leap. Okay? Yes. And pay it forward. Your rewards are coming in. But use discernment when it comes to people, places, and things. And that's what you're doing. You're keeping an eye on things. Some of you guys may be detectives or this person, FBI agents or law enforcement. Yes. Comfort. Black and white. Yin yang energy going on here. Again, black and white. Black balance. Comfort. Take it and give it. This is going to be an even give and take with this person. I'm telling you, you're going to be quite content and satisfied in the end with this person. This person is going to take care of you, nurture you, cook for you, clean for you. I'm telling you, this person has good manners. Even though they were, they're were they younger, for some of you guys, they were raised the right way. They have manners. Okay? Yes. They may have anger issue, but they have manners. They, they're not going to, you know, you're going to, you're going to check that. Like, hey, yo. Okay, <laughs> okay, all right, so let's get to this, and let's see here, what's the secret with this queen of pentacles?
that I'm going to pull some tarot. Two of Wands. Something is about to close out with this person. This person is possibly keeping an eye on you here as well. Okay. Yes. But this person is planning something. This person is all secretly watching your social media. Okay. But Spirit is protecting you from this person. Follow your intuition when it comes to this person. Uh-huh. This person may be cloaking themselves or doing some type of magic. Yes, two of swords. You block this person out from your energy. Okay. You're blocking people. Some of you guys are closing out your social media as well. Eight of cups. You walked away from this person. You're moving on with your life from this person. Or somebody leaving somebody behind here. Somebody's leaving somebody behind. Yes. Queen of... Queen of Wands, yes, this is somebody's secret competition. This is somebody in comp competition with you, or they feel you competition. They, you know, you're beautiful, you're handsome, you're productive, you're ambitious, uh, you're a leader, you're a go getter, you're fiery, you're passionate, you're all the things that this person is not. Uh, again, somebody may be walking away from this Queen of Pentacles. Somebody may be married here or was secretly married. They're leaving this person. You may have been the other person involved as well. Or you're leaving this person behind. This may be a same-sex relationship. Knight of Wands. Somebody was fucking around with this person here. Um, yes, possibly, you know, in a lustful energy or... Yes. Or nine of wands. So knight of wands and nine of wands. Somebody's not giving up on you here. Somebody possibly was just in and out of your life for sex. And you decided to walk away from this person because they were married here. Or this person here was living a double life. This queen of this queen of earth. This married person or this sister or uh, boss or landlord. Whoever this person is may have been living a double life and sleeping around with other people. They're not giving up on their title here. Some shit like this. Okay, yes, death. Something is coming to an end, though. Okay, somebody's ending something with this, this queen of earth here. Okay, because somebody found out either they were loose, sleeping around, or there's, there's somebody here that wants to be with you. Okay, Scorpio energy here. Or somebody may have, yes, somebody's ending something here and they want to build their legacy with you. Yes, somebody wishing and desiring you here, Page of Cups. Somebody has a crush on you, admires you. They see that you they, that you building your legacy here and they want to come in. Yes, they want to come in. They're not giving up on you here. And this person wants to take action. They're moving, they're coming in fearlessly. But you're moving forward fearlessly as well and building your legacy here. And you're putting your, yeah. So, but somebody's ending something here and they're desiring you. They're desiring to be with you. Somebody wants to apologize to you here as well. And again, this person may be younger. But this person, this person is in love. There you go. Judgment. They decided that they love you and they want to be with you. And they're that that you're their true love. But they may have been a pregnancy involved as well. Tower, this is going to take you by surprise because somebody's going to take a leap of faith towards you. They're gonna they want to take a chance towards you. Uh um Scorpio, Aries, Aquarius. But they see you free yourself. Okay, you decide to free yourself, but this person fell in love with you here. Um, yes, they fell in love as soon as you ended things here with them. Okay, and that's what some of you guys. All right, that's that's what this was about. But um, yeah, this is a secret competition here. Okay, yes, this could be. Uh, I I gave you all scenarios. What it could be. Okay, let's see who's watching you here. Who's secretly stalking you here? Nine of Pentacles. Okay, this may be somebody single that has their shit together, or they see that you have your shit together, not a care in the world, that you make yourself. Yes, this is an emperor. <laughs> this is some this is a boss. This is a boss that's planning something here that's being strategic. Um, Aries Taurus. Okay, this is somebody who's financially stable and abundant, single, or possibly a divorcee, has children. But this person is sitting on their throne. This person possibly have a dog as well. This person is coming in very loyal. Or this person may be born in the year of the dog. Some of you guys may love to drink red wine. Or this person drinks red wine. This person is very comfortable in their own. They know how to entertain themselves. All right. This person may be an earth sign. So it's Capricorn Virgo. Um, yes. This person may, be, may have been through a lot in life. Even though they're young. They may have been or witnessed a lot in life. But this person is very successful and have their shit together or they see that you have your shit together and you're single 
or this person may be, you know, a divorcee or married, okay, or a boss, but the boss, this person is a boss, a judge or business owner, yeah, they're, they're the boss, this person, oh my fucking goodness, I can't make this shit up, you're gonna go from the 9 to the 10, you're gonna end up marrying this person, this person's a business owner, okay, this person has their own production company, or, um, yes, lots of money and inheritance, monarchy sir yes sir yes ma'am this person is the fucking boss this person is stable this person possibly have a lot of properties into real estate sales acting politicians um multilingual but this person had this person is the shit this person wants to build with you they want to build this is a power couple this person wants to build their empire with you they're coming in stable secure this person may have children um but they want to have a baby with you if, even if the if you guys have adult children, they still want to try for a, a baby with you. Okay? Yes. There may be a... Yes. Six of Wands. This person gets a lot of fucking attention here. They see you get a lot of attention too. They want your attention. They don't know how. But they see... They find you to be very nurturing, very giving, very loving, very uh, successful. Uh, this person may, may, may want to propose to you. Yes. This person admires you. They they have great admiration for you here. This person is some type of artist. Like I said, they get a lot of attention too. Yes. Seven of Swords. Yes. Somebody's being strategic here. Or somebody's running away from their feelings here. Or yes. Or they have to sneak away here. Or they have to hide themselves from a family. Or yes. Or, or they're scared what people may think. Because they're looked up to and they have a title to uphold. Or... Yes, or this person is a people pleaser. They're scared about what people may think. But something is going on here. Yeah, Six of Pentacles. This person is a giver, not a taker. This person is coming in with a gift. They, they're they learning you. They, they're trying to get to learn you. Who are you? What do you like? What do you don't like? What the hell is going on here, Aquarius? <laughs> Six of Pentacles again. New deck. This person is a giver. This person is coming in with a gift, but this person is... is they want to give back to you. They want to make they want to be generous. They want to invest in you. They see you as a prize. That's something that they could build with to the legacy, to the ten of pentacles here. Yeah, I thought, yo, you're gonna be yo. What's this seven of swords about? Yes. Oh, somebody's doing black magic. Definitely. Somebody's doing black magic. Somebody's obsessed, secretly obsessed with you here. This person may have addictions, codependency, materialistic, or this is somebody here that's trying to get away from a toxic situation here. Um, yes. I see blockages, spirit blocking this out here. Okay, yes. Somebody may come off to be very knowledgeable, but they're not that very, that they're not that very, they're not that knowledgeable here, but somebody's definitely doing black magic here. Okay, or doing some type of spell work or learning this. Books, they're learning this, but it's blocked. This spell work is blocked. Okay, this is a King of Pentacles, Taurus, Capricorn, Virgo. Yes. Okay, this is a Taurus, Capricorn, Virgo that's obsessed with you, that's sneaky, that's deceptive, that's lying to you here, or was married here. Okay, um, it was one-sided. This person was an opportunist, was like stealing from you or lying about needing money here or using you. Okay, yes, Page of Pentacles. This person, this person wants to come in to offer you something here. They not, they're not offering much, or it possibly was friends with benefits here, or they're supporting some type of children here, or they have a gift. Yes, this person is married. The Hierophant. Uh, Taurus here. This person, yes, this person was fucking around in their marriage here, or coming in with friends from, you know, with just friends with benefits here. Uh-huh, Seven of Pentacles. Okay, this person may have been married for a very long time. Or been fucking around for a very long time. Or you were sleeping with this person for a long time. But this person is trying to come in. This person is being strategic and trying to come in. They want to they wanna, they wanna, they wanna, they wanna bring you a gift. But this person may be under spiritual attack. Or this person is doing some type of black magic to get back to you. Sex magic. Some type of magic they're doing here. Um, yes. This person is very passionate about you as well. They possibly want to settle down with you. But this person may be married. Okay, two of wands. Something is about to close out here. This person is planning something here. They're taking a long time, but they, they're trying to... Co yeah, they're blocked. Somebody's blocking them. Yes, some type of magic taking place. This person may live a distance from you, but you moved away from this person. 
Yes, blockages, blockages. Not speaking to this person. They want to come in. They're manifesting you. They want. They want. They, this person is doing magic. They're manifesting you. There may be a queen of cups involved and children. Somebody may have served them paperwork and they have to pay for children and they're suffering financially right now. Okay. Yes, they may have had a child outside of their marriage as well, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio, or they may have a lot of children. But this person is suffering financially. Uh, be careful with somebody reaching out to you, a Queen of Cups reaching out. Yeah, somebody secretly reaching out to you. Um, yes, but this person may have been entertaining a lot of people online. Possibly got somebody pregnant outside of their marriage, but I see blockages. Yes, somebody wants to free themselves from this. Yes, somebody wants to free themselves from this, but you cut this person out because they had a family. Okay, yeah, so this is this is that type of person up here that's coming through, that's watching you as well. This person is watching you as well. Somebody who was, you know, using you, as a using energy. You're not taking this person back. The Emperor's coming in. This person is going to be very jealous. Yeah, Page of Wands. Somebody wants to send you a message, or this person is going to send you a message um, as well. Secretly send you a message. Yes. You tamed the beast in this person, Pisces, Cancer, Sagittarius, Leo. Yeah. This person wants your forgiveness. Okay. They want a peaceful compromise between you and them. They're keeping their eye on you. They're manifesting you, praying for you here as well. This person possibly exercise. And eat. yeah, Wheel of Fortune. Yeah, but fate. Yeah, you're closing something out, but your 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 luck is about to change here and there's going to be a lot of gossip and a lot of jealousy surrounding this fucking situation here. You hear me? Yes. Two of Wands, Death card, the chariot. You moving forward. Follow your intuitions. Okay? I see a new house as well, but whatever you wish for is coming true. Okay? Yes. Seven of Pentacles, your heart at work. Rebuilding, rebuilding. Focused on work, but your hard work is going to pay off. Nine of Pentacles. But then it's going to go from the nine to the ten. The Emperor is coming in. And this person is very fucking successful. So whoever treated you wrong or was using you or whatever, they're going to see you. It's Destiny is at play here. Ten. Cycles closing out and you're entering into a new cycle. A new fruitful cycle. Okay, so you have people watching you, but the Emperor is watching you here. <laughs> yeah, the Emperor is watching you here. They're not saying anything, but the emperor is watching you here. Your divine masculine is coming in. This person looks good. All right. So let's see who's this person coming in. Because I have to end your reading, uh, Aquarius. <clears throat> que sera, sera. Yes. Whatever will be, will be. I mean, this is what you wish for. This is what you hope for, Aquarius. Give and take. Yes, follow your intuitions. You may need a reading for this, or this person is getting readings on you to see if you're the one, or they find you to be highly intuitive, mysterious, esoteric. Um, yes, <laughs> they may, uh, if you're a reader, they watch your channel and they're learning you. But again, they may reach out to you for a reading as well. Yeah. Yes, Knight of Pentacles, this person is single, or they find you to be single, unbothered, that you're just building your empire right now by yourself. You have not a care in the world. Okay, yeah, Page of Wands, they're going to send you a message. They are. They're going to take a chance. Five of Pentacles, they may have sent you a message, but you didn't respond or you didn't see it. Um, but I see you blocking people as well. Yes, they're afraid that you're going to leave them on read and you're not going to respond to them. But I see somebody who left, who who blocked you is coming back around. Yeah. Yeah, this may be a Taurus. Nine of Wands. Somebody's not giving up on you here, but right now you're very guarded. Okay, you've been hurt before. You're not getting hurt again. But so, yes, yeah, three, three of Swords. Somebody may have broke your heart, but somebody's heartbroken over you. Because I see that you don't give a fuck anymore. Yeah. Four of Pentacles. Yeah, somebody's suffering financially and still holding on to your energy. They feel like they, they let go of the treasure here. Somebody may be confined or locked up or stuck in another relationship. That's not your problem. But right now, you're all about saving money, healing from a heartbreak. You're very guarded. You're ghosting people. Yeah. Yes, justice. Somebody may be going to court, but somebody here wants to come in to be fair. This may be a Libra. Um, yes. Or somebody that works for the law. Well, you work for the Lord, but somebody wants to be fair here. Yes, Queen of Pentacles. Yeah, there's a Queen of Pentacles involved for some of you guys. 
Taurus, Capricorn, Virgo, or somebody that's married or a landlord or a boss. Knight of Swords. Somebody, a Queen of Pentacles might be reaching out to you. Be careful with this energy. Okay. This person may be going to court. Um, yes. Or a landlord. Um, somebody who's married or this could be over property as well. But somebody wants to reunite with you here. Be careful with this energy. This person is very jealous and envious. Um, this person may be getting evicted as well with the five pentacles or being finan or doing financially fucked up. Then we have the queen of cups. There's a lot of queens here. Yes, this may be a same-sex relationship, but, um, I see some type of celebration around a pregnancy, a home, or somebody inviting you to their home. Be careful now. Follow your intuitions. Uh, with the queen of cups here, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio, um, Somebody may live with someone here. Again, somebody may have been married and got somebody else pregnant. But somebody wants to get you pregnant here. But somebody finds you to be stable, secure, grounded. Somebody has to, a lot of you explain it to do. Yeah, page of one, uh, Ace of Wands, Nine of Cups. This is what somebody is desiring with you. Somebody is desiring to live with you, to have a family with you. They see that you're nurturing, caring, stable, grounded single yes the lovers somebody had lovers here but somebody you're gonna have a choice here okay but with the five of wands there's competition somebody have options here <laughs> yeah you're gonna have options too you're walking away from bullshit here when you meet this person this person may yeah, the Empress. This person may feel like you're going to reject them. This is a mirroring energy. This is your perfect match. Aquarius, Gemini, Libra coming through. Taurus, Libra. Somebody wants to build with you here. But somebody here is cutting people out here. And somebody here is very direct and straightforward and wants to speak their truth to you here. They find you to be their Empress. The Emperor came out the last time. And they're getting their money in order. They're, they're getting down to business. And sorting things out with these females or these males or whoever is in their life. They're sorting, they're sorting things out. Because they could be family involved in this situation. They don't really give a fuck. All right? Yes. Right now, they're, 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 they're working on something to build something here. To, to make like some type of financial payment towards these people. Whether it's a family or, or ex-wife or husband or children. They're working on something here to close something out. And they want to come towards their happiness, which is you. Yes, there we go. There we go. The emperor. There we go. To come towards his empress. Her, him, doesn't matter. This is unisex. To come towards their empress. To build a legacy with you. So there's certain, there, somebody sorting some type of money matters out. They're going to explain something to you here. Because there's going to be a lot of talk with family, friends. Could be opposed to this. There may be a different culture, background, religion. But I see that at the end... You guys are going to be successful together. This person sees their happiness with you, that they could build with you. These people are fake. They're money hungry. Somebody kept a baby or entrapment to keep someone. And now speaking um, to a lawyer, working with a lawyer here, the law, justice, to get something sorted out in terms of a home, marriage, who gets what, um, uh, to, get, um, to, 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 to get some type of paperwork in order for payment so that way... You know, this person could be at peace with you, moving on with you. Everybody's happy. Everybody, this person is a very hard worker and very intelligent as well. Because when they met you, you're everything that they desire in a person. Okay, but they're afraid that they're going to reject you. But a lot of people are going to be upset because this person is going to reject them. Okay, they're not happy with their circumstances. They're not happy with these people. And here, this is all you wanted is money. Here, take your money and go about your business so I can close this out with you guys once and for all and I can live at peace. I see this person is going to be ghosting these people as well. They're not going to be talking to them. Um, money is money. Money talks. That's how this person feels. Take your money and go. I, I want to I want to build with somebody else now. This is, my, this is who I want to build with. Whoa. Yes. That's how this person... This is this, just this, a lot of people are going to be heartbroken here. Okay? Because this person chooses you. They're perfect match. All the way around. They're perfect match. They, they know that you're a no nonsense kind of person and that you just not, don't, don't settle for less. You make your own money. They see it. Okay? They're going to see it. That you value yourself. That you're not money hungry and you don't, whatever, all that glitters is not gold. Yes. This person knows that they can't pull a fast one on you. You know the bullshit. But they know that you are nurturing and caring and loving and uh, you know, provider or settle down kind of person and they gonna they wanna build with you.
they may have like I said they're gonna sort their certain things out they're gonna they, they're gonna have their shit in order like that person look that person gets their money and that's it you don't need to they don't need to worry about this and you don't need to worry about them period okay <laughs> that's that's what I'm picking up here all right all right so let me pull some tarot <laughs> this is quite interesting I mean, yeah, they just want to live comfortably. They want, they want to, they want to live, live comfortable. That's it. Okay. This person is releasing something here. They're ready to jump into the unknown with you, but you're going to be quite satisfied with this person because they're going to make sure that you have all that you need and want. This person has money. Yes. They're a workaholic, but they're going to make time for you. All those other people were fake. They were just after money. They were superficial. They will, they, they, this person has a lustful energy, but they're going to be lustful with you. Do you understand what I'm saying? Uh, Aquarius, they have a, uh, yeah, they're going to be lustful with you. Okay. This person has a, like an old soul. Mm -hmm. Yeah. All right, spirit. Please give me two cards to start off Aquarius reading, please. Look at, look, it came out in reverse. Okay. I wanted to see what it is, but it came out in reverse like that. Okay, yeah, this person compromise or end the conflict. This person again, they're they're clearing some shit up. They're coming in. You don't have to worry, but there's competition around this person. But they're gonna make it very clear that they don't want them. Here's your money. I don't want you. Okay, we have children here. We have a payment. There's no need to talk. This is court. This is court ordered. And here you go. Sign this. And yes, but this person is is yeah, wheel of fortune. Okay, destiny is at play. A faded meeting coming between you and a person here. An agreement coming. Yes, but this person is not going to bring conflict or drama in your life. They don't want that. They want to compromise, make peace with people. Yes, but you're making peace with the past here. There is no competition when it comes to you. Okay, with anybody. And when they see you, they know it. They know it. Wheel of Fortune, your good luck is coming around. Karma is at play here. Destiny chances at play here. King of Wands in reverse. With the King of Wands in reverse. Okay. Um, Aquarius, Taurus, Leo, Scorpio, Taurus, uh, Taurus. I said Taurus. This may be a Taurus or uh, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. Okay. This person, somebody here is very deceptive here, is a liar, a con artist, materialistic. This could be your own children, a friend of yours, an ex of yours. This person sleeps around, have an STD. Careful now. But somebody's getting their karma. Somebody's getting their karma. Okay. This person is very selfish, you know, boastful, arrogant, prideful, stubborn. Yeah, secret. Yeah, there's some type of secrecy surrounding the person here. This person may have health condition as well. Um, yes, this person is for the streets, criminal background. The moon card, uh, Pisces, Cancer. There's a secret surrounding this person. This person is money hungry. There we go. This person is money hungry, an opportunist, liar, cheat. Yes, let's see what this uh, moon card is about. Let me get this deck. What is this moon card about with this uh, King of Wands in reverse? This person may be homeless as well, but this person is money hungry. This person is boastful, like act like they got it like that, but they don't. This person may come in as a friend, but, you know, there's, the secret is, is that they're a user, a liar, cheap, okay, stingy. What's the moon card? This person is, is, is pocket watching. Two of swords, secrets being revealed. I'm revealing their secrets right now. Yes. There's a disloyalty when it comes to this person. But, yes, putting an end to this. This person, the end, you may find out somebody um, passed away. But, yeah, whatever it is, this person can't bullshit you. You know what it is with this person. You know that this person talks a lot of hot shit. But you don't want anything from this person, whoever this is. This may be a Scorpio. Yes, five of wands, competition. There we go. This person had a lot of drama. They come in like they don't have any drama in their life, but this person likes drama in their life. They like it. You know, they know that they can't pull that shit with you. But this person here is money hungry, an opportunist. This person is watching your money here. This could be a friend of yours, a family member as well. Competition, secret competition with you. Yeah, nine of swords. This person here is stressed the fuck out. This person is a headache or would stress you the fuck out here. Okay, but this person has a lot of guilt and, re guilt and regret with you. Yeah, what I said, the money. The money. This person is money hungry. This person felt like they lived. This person with the wheel of fortune, the king of wands in reverse, 
the moon card and the ace of pentacles this person feel like they missed their big opportunity with you yes you were the big kahuna you were the blessing that came into their life and they didn't they didn't see it you were their lucky charm you were their good luck to turn around their circumstances and this had came to an end because this person had a lot of drama, kept you in drama, gossiping, a lot of people, sleeping around with people. Oh, you saw all those women? Uh, women, men, but this person could possibly sleep with both. But whatever it is, this person had a lot of drama. Put you to third party for some of you guys, or this could be a family member. But now this person feel like they missed their opportunity when it came with you. How to regain that? Because you don't look at, you look at this person like a piece of shit. Garbage. They're trash to you. Yes. Mm -hmm. But there's a big opportunity coming in for you and some money. Yes, the world. This has closed out with this person. They missed their window of opportunity with you. Okay, shut up, shut up. I mean, hey, yo. Okay, yes. And you're going to be doing big things because there's a new opportunity coming in with you uh, in, terms with, in terms of money, a back payment, a job opportunity, um, your business taking off, but somebody else, you know, noticing you from the internet. Yes, you, yeah. This window has closed out, and this person is gone. This person is homeless, financially fucked up, health issues, unemployed. Yes, with somebody, with somebody. This person possibly chose somebody over you, but this window's opportunity is closed for this person. They missed their big shot with you, and they know it, and they regret it. They regret choosing somebody over you or what they did to you, okay? This person possibly gave you an STD as well. That's for some of you guys, okay? Yes, but who's fucking around with people? Hold on. Right now, you don't give a fuck about people and their circumstances. Right now, you're just banking it, but you're moving in silence. And you're keeping quiet about your money moves and about your money and your opportunities because you know you have opportunists around you. Yes. This person was a user. Yes, four wands. There we go. I see you getting some type of new property as well. Business taking off. Some of you guys may be plays or stand up and speak to the public. Again, some type of performers, athletes, or this person is an athlete that's coming in. But I see a new home coming in for you guys, stabilizing yourself. I see an invitation as well to some type of reunion, house party, baby shower, something like this, okay? Yes, but I see you guys moving and moving on up. Yes, but um, whatever it is, somebody wants to propose to you here, move in together. Somebody's going to propose moving in together. Now, be careful with this king of wands in reverse let me see specifically what this person's sign is okay who is this person this king of wands in reverse this person may have may not have children as well this person is feeling rejected yes what i said this person here missed their opportunity with you and they're feeling regret remorse they're missing you because they were low vibrational they were low vibrational. This person is possibly a Scorpio, a Cancer here. Um, yes, this person possibly sleeps around, sleeps with both sex. Yep, King of Cups, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. This person possibly have a baby mom, but this person is desiring you. They feel like you're their perfect match. This person fell in love with you. A player fell in love with you guys as well. Yes, that's the truth. Yes, now they see that you're the one for them. Okay, but it's too late. They missed their window of opportunity for being a, a fuck, fuck, fuck boy or fuck girl or thot, whatever you want to call it. Um, yes, but I do see some type of um, acting or, you know, auditioning going on here. But moving, moving, moving. Yeah, ten of wands. Somebody may be married here, struggling in a marriage as well or in a household or not having the financial means to support um you know to keep up to upkeep with bills and or this could be you um yes but you feel overburdened bur overloaded but there was somebody who took took you for granted here okay um yes but somebody's still holding on to your energy as well holding on to you mm -hmm. yes two of pentacles juggling this person is nervous borrowing money to pay back money here is un in instability here okay this person was possibly married and fucking around in a marriage here um, but right now you're, 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 you're juggling a lot right now. Okay. But you're, you're not putting too much on your plate. Accountability. You're holding people accountable for their actions here. Basically that. So if they're fucked up, that's their problem. That's their household. That's, I got my own fucking bills and my own responsibilities. That's how you feel about shit. You're prioritizing right now. Organizing. Okay. But a partnership. 
They want somebody wants to partner up with you here. Somebody may need to borrow money from you as well. You're, that's a big no. That's a big no. But somebody's nervous about you. Knight of Pentacles came out fumbled. Yeah, with the Knight of Pentacles coming out fumbled here, somebody took too long. Their window, they, again, uh, again, their time has ran out. You was possibly waiting, waiting, waiting. This person is possibly lazy, not put empty promises, broken promises, not putting in effort. You was like, fuck you. Okay, now you're rebuilding yourself. You're focused on work, but you're taking your time, your sweet fucking time. Okay, yes, judgment. This is their personal karma, will of fortune and judgment. This is their karma. With the five of wands in reverse, what competition? You're not arguing with anybody. You're not fighting with anybody. Yes, but somebody wants your forgiveness here. They do. Okay? But you're going through a renewal process. Somebody's awakening to the reality. Okay? What they did to you. Yes. But you reap what you sow. Sagittarius Scorpio energy. Yes. There, there you go. You reap what you sow. And you're winning. You're winning. The judgment is on them. Whatever they did to you is backfiring. Now they're financially fucked up. They're... Uh, instability homeless unemployed health issues struggling with people struggling with somebody but there may be a family involved as well that's keeping that's holding this person back hold on yes you're overcoming you're winning and they see you winning they want your attention but i see somebody coming in that's very successful and they see you very successful i see award coming your way recognition yes you get a lot of attention or somebody gets a lot of attention here Okay, but triumphing. Page of Pentacles, a job opportunity coming in, a new job, promotion. But somebody here wants to pass off an idea to you. Okay, a proposal. Somebody wants to take you on a date, a business date as well. Um, yes, this person may be younger, Taurus Capricorn Virgo. I have Aries of Sagittarius. Um, yes, but I see a pay increase for you guys, some type of good news coming in um, surrounding money. Some of you guys may be going back to school, getting some type of scholarship for your children. Or this person is on some type of scholarship, adolescent. <laughs> I'm just saying. Um, but yes, this person may be some type of sports um, workout. This person works out. This person has a nice body. Okay? Yes. A nice stature as well. A nice face. Yes. Okay? But this is somebody that wants to learn from you as well. But you're setting goals for yourself. Opportunities are opening up for you sometimes. <laughs> to a cup. What I said. Two of Cups. This is going to lead to a Two of Cups. A partnership. Somebody wants to partner up with you. Teamwork. Make the dream work. That's how they feel. Okay? But this is going to be love. Okay? True love. New love. Somebody's in love. But this is going to be a... Turn, this is going to be a relationship. Somebody wants a relationship with you. Okay? They want to see where it goes here. They want to partner up with you. Come in union with you. Okay? Yes. Three of Pentacles. What I said. I can't make this up. Yes, somebody's coming in fearless. This person has a lot of sex drive. I mean, this person's stamina is what I said. <laughs> I see you marrying this person. The Hierophant, Taurus energy. A lot of pentacles here, cups, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. Uh, Cancer coming through. Capricorn coming through. With the three of pentacles, this person wants to join your team. They want you to. They feel like you make a great team. Okay, they want to get on the same page. I see signing documents, uh, 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 making something official, a business, opening up a business together, getting on the same page. This person, uh, again, student. Okay, yes. Some of you guys may be opening up a program where people have to sign up um, your own training course, basketball course, um, tennis. You, ch you, teach some, you teach something to others or somebody, t this person is a mentor or a motivator, something like this. But you guys are going to be working together, hand in hand. This person, yes, you're going to, you're going to be in a limelight together, the spotlight together. Yes, this person is going to marry you. There's going to be a lot of, your sex life is about to pick up. I ain't going to lie. Somebody may be ending a marriage or may, may be a widow here as well. This is a spiritual union between you and this person here. Okay, I did see a queen of, uh, a king of cups, Pisces, Castor, Scorpio. This person is coming in emotionally available with a lot of love to give, a lot of sex as well. But this person is fearless, okay? Yes. Now, there may be somebody here that was fucking around in a marriage, infidelity. That's why the marriage is ending, okay? Yes. Four cups in reverse. Yes, there's a missed opportunity coming back around for you. You're seizing opportunities as well. You're letting go of regret. Okay, but this is an end of stagnation. Motivation picking up. Okay, yes, the Empress. Oh, boy. There we go. With the Empress here, 
some of you guys may be leaving a king of cups behind as well the emperor the empress here the emperor is coming in that's what i gotta say they they find you to be their match okay somebody's in love with you in love with who you are as a person they admire you admire your work uh the way you dress they could somebody somebody's imagining the way you smell this person smells good this person likes cologne and perfume they wondering if you like cologne and perfume um yes they're trying to figure you out but they're 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 trying to figure out how you smell <laughs> i don't know that just picked that up okay so how you smell they think that you smell good you look good do you look do you smell as good as you look something like this but they find you to be a masterpiece like a fucking like the fucking mona lisa here da vinci out this motherfucker <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, Libra. But they're gonna fit, they're gonna put you in charge, like hair, you know, or they're gonna set something up for you, just for you in your name. Yes, something like this. Okay. Wow. This is yes, King of Pentacles, Taurus, Capricorn, Virgo. This is a business person. I see a King of Cups as well. This is a business person. Okay, they don't feel like they don't they they know that they don't measure up to you here, but this person is financially stable. They want to they want you to know that they financially stable, that they could build with you, that they're a team player, that they could grow with you, that you know, hey, I could be the man that you want. I want to show and prove something like this. Something like this. This may be a Sagittarius as well. Okay. Follow your intuition. Yeah, they want to work with you. There you go. They want to build with you. They want to work with you. They want to put in the time and effort. You may meet this person through work. This person is coming in business-minded. This person is a, is a workaholic as well. Yes, you're going to have something to say about this. Like, hey, you don't meet my standards, but they're afraid of your mouth. They're afraid that you're going to reject them. They're afraid. <laughs> they don't want to miss this opportunity with you, though. They 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 want to show and prove. They're putting in that work to build themselves up to the emperor. Yes, yeah, six of cups. This person may have children as well. This person may be younger. This person is very loving, very caring. This may be a past life love. It's a soulmate. But you have a divine union coming in. You're going to have options. But there's somebody from your past coming back that's going to shock you. That's going to shock you. This person wants to come in and be fair. This person may work for the law. Um, be some type of lawyer or studying the law. But they want to balance things out here. This may be a friend, a family. Yes. Okay. Yes, yes, yes. Um... Yeah, but you're going to have something to say here about this. Like, hey, 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 hold your horses. But this is somebody from your past that wants to build with you here. They're coming in. Yeah, they're going to send you. Uh, uh, psh, look at this. I, I saw it. Yeah, they're going to send you a. Okay. They're desiring you. Wow, look at this. Look at what I saw. Somebody's going to send you a message. Possibly on the internet, email. They're trying to figure you out how to reach out to you. There's a new love coming in, okay? A wish fulfillment of yours. Somebody single, abundant. But somebody finds you to be single and abundant. Somebody's in love with you here. But there is definitely a new love coming in. Somebody wants to take you on a date as well, okay? Yes. Uh-huh. Somebody feel like you're going to reject them, but somebody wants to fight for your love here. Um, yeah. I see that you're going to be holding back. You're, 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 you're being selfish, and not selfish in a bad way, selfish in a good way because you were so given to others and now you're holding back. Now your 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 accountability, show and prove. Show and prove. Put that work in. You're gonna make them work hard. You're gonna make people work. You're gonna make them work for this. Work work for my love. You gotta earn my fucking love here. You just can't tell me that you love me and that's it. You're gonna yes, you're gonna have you're gonna have options here when it comes to love. But somebody may have put you in a third-party situation. But when it comes to lovers, you're going to have options here. Somebody feels inferior to you, insecure. They possibly feel like they put you in a situation or they, you know, yes. Or somebody's locked up here. But whatever it is, they're coming in. They're coming in to fight, okay, for your love. Fight for a position here. You're going to have to think about this. But you're releasing, okay. You're holding back. You're going to be holding back and you're going to maintain your independence, here until they show and prove. K said, ah, shit, ah. That it is what whatever whatever will be will be. That's what it means, right? Yeah. Whatever will happen will happen. Well, whatever will be will be. Italian. This person may be Italian, or you may be Italian, or you're traveling there. Okay, but whatever it is, this person' love language is gift giving and touching, physical, physical touch. Okay, but. <laughs> Go Aquarius. I mean, you're a no-nonsense kind of person here. All right, let's end this reading, Aquarius, because I'm going overtime. This is a true love, though. This gonna, this person's gonna show, show you. They're gonna show you. 
there we go relationship they're gonna show you first card money matters they're gonna put in that they're gonna put in that work but your money's about to pick up here as well yes this person is a gift giver like i said there's gifts here there's blessings coming in rewards okay great match this is gonna be a great match <laughs> i can't make this up power couple relationships business partners you're gonna be bit to a couple business partners office love affairs office love affairs and communication with co-workers okay so business partners office love affairs and communication with co-workers are highlighted now make choices with extreme care choose wisely great match this is going to be a great match whoever you choose is going to be a great match or somebody feels that you're their great match you are the one you are on the verge of finding the perfect work for you yes and relationship but again an offer love offer don't give up. You may need to grow your own business to be truly happy. And this person is going to make you truly happy. They are. You're going to be truly happy. Okay? Uh-huh. <laughs> uh-huh. Um, hold on. This person may be into real estate. Okay? That's the first card I saw. Or you may be into real estate. Excuse me animator this person may be an animator voice actor uh, paralegal okay quality inspector quality management inspector geologist a winemaker electrician interior designer graphic designer tattoo coach okay a coach uh, tattoo artist, sales representative, mechanical engineer, human resource manager, a lawyer, web designer, uh, pharmacist, engineer, security analyst, multimedia artist. Yes, this person may be some type of artist, dent, uh, dental hygienist, or you. Uh, yeah, this person may be a coach, like I said, or, or into some type of sports, architect, elementary school teacher, or school teacher, principal, bank teller, work for the bank, HVAC technician, emergency medical technician, or some type of doctor, or PA, or nurse, yeah, social media manager, or be have a social media present, fashion design, presence, fashion designer, uh, costume designer, Okay, a dress up zoning inspector, um, environmentalist, medical records technician, entrepreneur, journalist or journalism, uh, or so, um, news reporter, urban planner, home health aide, I do see a baby, dental assistant, or OBGYN, carpenter, massage therapist, medical doctor, yes, Zigbee developer, event planner, but there's an event coming up. Okay, hold on. Yes, yeah, so, yes, making up for the time I lost here. So, yes, I hope you guys enjoyed this reading. Aquarius, <laughs> it's quite a reading. But, Plum, yes, Karma. Yeah, people are going through their Karma. Karma, structure, discipline, and sweet victory for you. What I said. Wait for it, babes. Wait for it. Grapes, gossip, there's going to be gossip, signs, divine guidance, discovery, and teamwork. Yes, this person may be athletic, like I said, athletic in the beginning, strong in faith, confident, protective over you. There's going to be, they're going to be very protective, but you guys are going to be the best of friends. See eye to eye. And uh, papaya, spiritual cleansing. So you need a spiritual cleansing. Spiritual cleansing mentally, physically, and emotionally. Spiritual chains have been broken. Yes. Recovery from illness. In the beginning, recovery from illness. Look, your spirit seem, uh, said real, said it. Recovery from illness, grounded, introverted, um, stressed, and hereditary cancer. So somebody may be suffering from cancer. And Lyme, triumph, financial blessings, lifestyle change, and fearlessness. Everything I just said. Okay? And one of these, and I'm closing out your reading, Aquarius. And it's not personal projection. Balance needed. It's not personal. You're staying away from people. 
Many times, others project their own pain onto you. This situation is not personal, but rather an opportunity for compassion for yourself and the other person involved. Stop taking the blame by automatically thinking it's your fault. Have discernment of what you own, but also what isn't your problem. What I said, this is your problem. Okay, sera, sera. Like, that's their problem. Okay, but you're staying away from broke people. You're not fucking with people like, yo. I don't fuck with broke people, babes. You're only a broke person make you broke. That's your karma. That's your problem. Deal with it. Accountability. Okay? But, hey, hey, yo, it's a good shit coming in for you guys. Uh, but I love you guys. I have to go now. Um, I'm possible. You're possible. Your girl, Tosh. I'm out.